Savannah. Um, I am in the program in experimental and molecular medicine, otherwise known as PEM, and I am in the neuroscience and physiology track. And I study the brain and how it regulates blood pressure and in the context of high blood pressure. And your brain controls everything you do, whether it's conscious like waving or unconscious like your heart beating and your lungs breathing. So most people in the United States that have high blood pressure have something called neurogenic or essential hypertension, meaning that they don't have another disease that causes it, like diabetes or something that would cause hypertension as a side effect. So these vast majority of people who have high blood pressure with no known cause, there's a lot of debate as to what the primary source of the high blood pressure is. Our lab focuses on the role of a few types of neurons in the hypothalamus that regulate blood pressure and heart rate. And using different viral methods and different drugs, we can actually manipulate these neurons and show that they do control the baseline um, of your heart rate and blood pressure. And using this research, we can potentially come up with therapeutics or drugs that can help decrease the blood pressure of people who have high blood pressure and don't really have a cure or a cause at this point.